Greetings, everybody, and welcome back. Uh, I'm Burnt Oak Guy, and uh, this is my stream. <laughs> kind of butchered that one a bit. <laughs> all right, so it's all good. Um, so last episode, we did quite a bit. We got all the way to Red Science, which is uh, pretty awesome, if I'm not mistaken. And then we set up a few little things. Uh, today's stream, I want to do a little things a little bit differently. Um, well, differently. I want to kind of tackle my way up to here a little bit, and I want to at least complete this section over here uh, in order for us to uh, at least get a satchel and some cobblestone generation would be nice. And these are just things that I'm going to complete along the way. So we already did conduits, so that'll unlock as soon as we do a tier 2 drill, which is a steel drill head. Then we'll get tin, lead, silver, nickel, gold, and quartz. So that's going to be pretty awesome. Um, what I did between streams, though, is uh, I gathered lots of resources, and I moved our little area up to here. Um, the only reason why I moved it is because I wanted a different grass. Like, I, I like the color of this grass more than this one over here so but i did all the resource gathering pretty much all down here and then i brought everything up here afterwards so it was uh pretty good pretty good so we got quite a bit of uh resources gathered um so let's go check out what i've done over here try not to run or to jump because like it's kind of annoying when you look at that so um as soon as we get like speed boots that would be absolutely friggin awesome i can't wait that's uh, just going to be totally awesome, especially when we get concrete. That's pretty much one, one of the main reasons why I want to go down the uh, the road for cobblestone generation. Is that way I don't have to be mining cobblestone. I can just create it. So this is where I've been collecting some wood. Um, I, it works out pretty good so far. So I just brought over our furnaces here. I added eight more. So we get a nice... Nice, good, fast generation. Uh, I've been making out uh, some steel and I've been making uh, a little bit of, uh, what the heck is that called? Modularium. So I'll show you exactly how much resources we've been gathering. So we got this so far here. Uh, we got a bunch of redstone. This drawer is completely full. So there's 2,048 redstone in that drawer. Then we got uh, all this stuff over here. Then we got these two drawers are absolutely full. So that's, uh, we're looking at about three, 4,000 iron that I've accumulated so far. And we got uh, 700 steel plus whatever I'm generating here. Um, then over here, what we have is we got our research. I didn't hook anything up, but I did kind of like start setting it up in uh, a cheap automation. So that way we can kind of get a little bit of research along the way because we haven't done anything since the last episode uh i got 125 here and we got two uh there well, i had to make two more i went to make only one but whatever it was for a screenshot more or less so yeah all right so i guess we'll go and we'll set this up first and then let's grab some base resources um i think do I, no redstone required I'm going to have to make a bunch of sticks, but I do have like lots of wood, so I'm not really worried about it, which is a very dandy. All right, so let's fill up that chest full of sticks or that uh, drawer over there full of sticks. And then uh, we'll know we'll have that taken care of for quite a while anyways. I don't know. Okay, I didn't think I was going to be able to uh, to fit them all in, but that's good. Very good, very good. All right, so... Let's put those there. Uh, first recipe we got, I think I did all the recipes too. So that way we uh, we know what we're feeding. Yeah. All right. So we're good on that. So this one here is going to be copper. So we're going to put in copper in this one. Uh, yeah, copper in that one. I'll probably end up going to get a lot more copper. Um, this one... This is going to be iron, but I think I put iron in the middle here, so I don't think I need this one. Oh, uh, those are for the plates. That's true. So I got to make a bunch of plates and put plates in that one. Uh, this one here is going to be for iron. That's the sticks. This one's going to be for steel. So I'm just trying to like map out things on what's for what here. All right. So 
This is going to need that. That's going to need it. So we're going to go like that. We'll put it on round robin so it shares. Uh, hopefully. <laughs> All right. And then we'll go insert and we'll insert. So that should send that in here. We should be making gears. Uh, so we'll put iron here and iron here, here. Uh, that, that, all uh, that, that, and then we'll insert, and then we'll insert. There we go. So that's going to take care of the iron. I'm going to go get a bunch of resources over here. That way I can fill up those, those chests or those drawers. So let's go take that for now. Get as much as we can going on here. Uh, so that was iron. That's that. All right, so I'll grab a little bit more iron, some steel. Uh, iron. And then we'll grab some steel. That's good. Don't want to use all of our steel. We'll just toss that there. And we'll toss that there. That's good. All right, so that should be getting all the iron it's going to need for quite a little while. Uh, that's going to start making these whenever this starts doing their thing. So I have to send in sticks now. So we'll put that on insert. This one we can just put straight extract. It's only going into one spot. Same with this. I can go insert and extract. So there, we'll start making gears. Uh, this should start making those. That's good. So we'll put this one on extract and that one on insert. So that should start sending those over and we're going to make those. That's beautiful. Um, so this is where we're going to have to kind of color code things a little bit. I think that's how it's going to work. Um, so this can go... We'll just do something like that and that. And then this is going to go here. Because that's what's going to feed it uh, its fuel, right? That's good stuff. All right, just beautiful. Now, let's uh, set up this right here. So we'll make this uh, a blue channel. Or, sorry. That has to be extract on a blue channel. We'll uh, go like that, insert. And we'll do this one, a blue channel here. I can go insert. So these should start filling up with that. Then this one here, we'll go to the next one. Oh, I did it again. That, we'll extract it. This can go here. And then this should be filling up with gears. Is that not making gears? No, no gears. What did I do wrong here? Insert. Always active. That should be pulling out steel. No. Stealing it. Steel gears. Why didn't that go in? Steel. Oh, that's because I grabbed modularium. Hey, I'm good. There we go. Oh, my lord. All right. So that's why that was in there. <laughs> All right. Now, we should be making gears. So that's good. That's good. Gears are going in here now. So we should be making that research. Now, this stuff here. Um, I guess we'll do the blue and purple thing again since like these lines aren't connected at all so we should be fine if i were to go and put like a a cable here well then i couldn't use those colors but or do we do different colors again hmm. i guess we'll do different colors just to make it safe so we'll go cyan extract on that one and then here we'll go cyan Insert. Uh, I guess we should put these to round robin. That way it shares. Then cyan. So that one's taken care of. And then after cyan is light gray. 
Always active, found round robin. Put this one to light gray. And last one, light gray. All right, so that should be slowly starting to fill up with stuff as it makes it. So what are we waiting on gears? Oh, that'd be really handy if I put a, uh, if I turn that on, right? Yeah, man. All right, so now I should be sending gears over. That's good. All right, so let's get up here and set those up. That way we can put fuel in here. Uh, we'll just go stay on the green for now because I don't see why not. This is uh, all just one closed circuit, so. And that and that. And each one of these should be filling up with, there we go, that's perfect. Now, if uh, everything's got enough resources, see, that's good doing its research. That's missing items. What are we missing here? Uh, oh, yeah, the uh, copper or the um, the plates, right? So let's get these out. Uh, take that there. Grab a whole bunch of these. All right, so... We shall make some plates. I don't know uh, how many I'm going to make, but we'll make quite a few. Uh, I'm going to need some sticks here. Let's make... Uh, oh, it's going to be these right here, right? Yeah. So let's make at least two more. And then we'll do at least two more sets like this. Yeah, that sounds good. I uh, may as well use up the rest of that hammer and we'll make a fresh one afterwards. How's that? That sounds like a plan, Stan. All right. Oops. That should go here and here. Just beautiful. And then we'll put that on reserves. And then we'll come back and we'll put that over here. So that's good. That's good. A little bit of progression, right? There we go. So now we got a bunch of plates in there. This should be getting plates. That's going to make some science. That's just beautiful. So with what's left, I should be able to hook up the rest of this, which is pretty good. All right. Very good. Very good. Uh, extract. This one we can take off. And then this one we'll extract from. Insert. Excellent. Just beautiful. So now... That's fully automated. All right. So now we just got to keep up like the resources on the inside, right? So at least uh, if we see these drawers ever empty out, we'll have a good idea that we have to come back and, and fill some stuff up. All right. Very good. Very good. Very good. All right. So now I said I wanted to get down some of these quest lines here for, uh, this is like mainly for decoration and this later on we might use a, uh, if we need to find out how much of something is going to cost us, like in resources uh, wise here. So this apparently you can break down. So we'll do that just to get that quest over and done with. It's going to give us all kinds of different uh, types of saplings, which is very nice. So we'll just do that. Um, apparently each one of these, um, those little tiny small ones will... We'll smelt one item, so that's interesting. So now we got that. So what I like about the chisel is we can like take different blocks and we can make them into something worthwhile. Um, so we'll grab. Uh, well, we got some cobblestone in here, so we we'll use cobblestone as an example. Oh, I forgot to put that away. So we'll use our chisel in our hand and then we get this little uh, UI pop up and we toss in our cobblestone here and then we could chisel out any kind of one of these designs for like cobblestone. And then say if we wanted to do that with like wood, well, we could grab a bunch of wood here and we could do that with wood too. So we can get different types of style of planks and stuff like that. So I'm going to use probably stuff like this there for, um, for like decoration and all that good stuff. 
Uh, I think that's what I'm going to end up doing. But for now, we'll just throw that in there because I have no idea exactly how I'm going to do my layout. I got an idea. So if you look at the area, I think this area should be big enough for us to do our pretty much all our entire factory on. I'm hoping. So I think I'm going to have like a main drag coming down like this. And then we will build up kind of like like this. And every time we build a section, it's going to be like have its own power. So that way, um, later on, when I get better power transfer cables, I can make it all one grid. But uh, as for now, we'll do everything with just like single grids. So I figure we'll make like, um, like my home area here where we gather all of our resources and all that stuff where everything comes home. And then after that, we'll have our items go out through different piping systems and uh, that will do auto crafting and all kinds of good stuff like that there's uh, all kinds of great possibilities that we can achieve today well today in future streams um so now we need this little thing sometimes i want to know how many raw resources it takes to make something but i don't want to bother with all the math yeah no kidding the crafting calculator will do all that math for me uh, i just need to tell it the recipes and yeah here we go Good stuff. And they give me a crafting calculator too. So here, for example, you can shift click recipes in here. So say I wanted to make, um, I guess blast brick would be pretty good. So I could sit there and go, can you do this? No way. I thought you could shift click your recipe in there. Go recipe, new recipe. Uh, blast brick probably have to what's this outputs catalysts inputs oh boy uh, allows you to create edit recipes to create one recipe you can just pick the item up from the GI that's what I thought put it in the slot when finished simply click the slave button you can also fast transfer recipes Wow all right, that's a lot to, to do. So, man, can I just do something like that? And then add label. Where do you see save? There's no save. Oh, do I do that? I'm confused. I really am. Or do you just pick it up, say I wanted to do that, and put it here? No? What about here? No? Hmm. All right. Well, I guess I'll play with that later. <laughs> <laughs> I'll figure it out. It's all good. Um. All right. So, at least we got that for later on. I can figure out how to lose, use that. All right. So, next task is we want to do some... Uh, get these. So... We need the previous drill heads, which is okay. We have those. And then we're going to need steel blocks. So let's grab a bunch of steel here. I think that should be enough. I think that was pretty much all my steel. All right. I think it was four per. Yeah. So I'll have uh, more steel over here. Yeah, it's coming in. All right. Oh, I had the other one that's on me as well. All right, that's good, that's good. Uh, do I go get the drill heads now? I think I will. Uh, let's down this way. So I'll try not to jump because it's annoying. There, get out of my way. Try to run down here and get uh, those drill heads uh, at least and make those ones into the steel ones. I think that would be great. And then we can start getting the tier two ores and kind of continuing on. I think that would be just absolutely beautiful. So, I don't know. I think I should just grab all these and bring them back with me. Instead of running over here all the time. I did make quite a bit of resources. So, I think that's what I'm going to do. We'll just take all these home with me. And then we'll find the equivalent resources up there. I think that would be a good idea. That's for darn sure. Alright, here we go. I could be using my hammer. That'd be a little bit quicker. There we go. 
just beautiful. Just beautiful. There you go. And that's it. That's all. Pick up that last drill head. We didn't lose anything. Okay, now let's go back and we'll make those into some steel ones. We'll get whatever steel we can, which will be good. Uh, I think there's what's left in there. Should almost have enough stacks to do it. Uh, I think it was almost two stacks. No, it was a stack and eight I needed in order to make uh, those eight, which isn't bad. So let's see if I got a... Oh, yeah, I definitely do, because there was like 40-something in here. Oh, beautiful. All right, so let's go back over here. Need to make a whole one like that. And then just one like so. And then I got the 16. So if I grab these. Uh... Oh, yeah. So why then? Just iron drill head and then the blocks can get you the same drill and you can save yourself four iron. What? That's a, okay, sure. I'll I'll take the cheesy way out. Yeah, that's what I'll do. So if I go like this and like so, we'll do this, that, and voila. So now we got uh, four steel. So now if we go, um, so there's going to be like resources all over the place, and they mine faster too, which is pretty handy. So we'll claim all that. Uh, we'll put these in here with our scanner. So tin, that, 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 and I knew there was something I was missing. And that. So our tier two ores. I guess I didn't need that in there. We'll just put here like this so we kind of know what is what. There we go. So this was uh, all your tier one, like um, all iron or whatever. And this is going to be your steel one. And then after that, we have, I think, one more tier of uh, materials that we can get a hold of. Uh, so, yeah, we're doing pretty good, doing pretty good. Uh, let's get rid of some of this. Fuel that up. Wouldn't be a bad idea. Then we'll get rid of some of that other stuff that I have on me here. There we go. <gasps> nope, silver. Uh, thank you. That was close. So there's another one. Perfect. All right, so let's set up these drills. Um, What's near here? Because then maybe I can kind of cheat a little bit here. All right, well, let's start with this chunk. We got copper, redstone, tin. Silver ore. Stuff I'm actually going to need, but what do we got here? Copper. More tin. Silver. Aluminum. Aluminum is going to be your tier 3 ore, which isn't so bad. Alright. What do we got over here? More copper. Tin. Just want to see what's around the base there right quick. Copper, tin. So I guess we're, that's lead, aluminum, thorium, and uranium. So that's another tier three ore. Iron. Should be some gold around here, hopefully. Without going too far. And we got lots of iron, lots of coal, which is pretty good. No complaints. Copper, gold. So there was gold in this chunk right here. So let's uh, let's do something here like this. So we'll take from this chunk. Then we'll take from this chunk. And then we'll do the same thing on all four of these. That's good. So we'll extract from here. We'll extract from here. Uh, I gotta put the chests on now. You're gonna see a huge difference with these there. These are just gonna like 
make all kinds of good stuff. I'm going to need uh, some coal. Forgot the coal. There we go. And uh, let's get rid of that because that's kind of annoying. So let's go plunder this, I guess, again. One, two, three, four. Because I don't see me making that much research. So let's go here. And you're going to see, like, once I put all this in there, the resources are going to come in quite fast, I find. And then I think it's a little bit faster than what it was before. So we're going to definitely get uh, all the good stuff. Iron and... And then whatever is going to jump up on this side, more coal and copper, nickel. Yeah, see, that's going to be great. We'll have a good little variety of things in here that uh, we're going to set up for mining. All right. So, and then we're not too far from our smelter either. We can just go and take that and throw it over here. So what is next? What is next? Uh, these electric miners. Oh, uh, I guess I'm going to have to upgrade, huh? So what's in the research? Where would those electric miners be processing? Alloy furnace, metal press, assemblers. That's power. Materials. It wouldn't be in here yet. See, this is where we're going to go down this path soon enough as well. And then here. Basic research. Research is nice and all, but if I want to get out of here, I'm going to have to do more advanced research. This new research burner can do everything our research burner can do, but it costs electricity. Okay, well, we're not there yet, so we're just going to leave that be. Okay, power drill. So 16 and 32. Uh, what do we got? What do we got? So 17, so we can do that and that. So let's do that electric one. Beautiful. Look at that. That's wicked. All right. So we unlocked it. That means we can go and build it now. And heavy engineering. Okay. So we're getting kind of complicated stuff here. So do I actually have to build it in order to get past it though? Or can I just go straight for the cobblestone? I'm going to need lead. Oof. Is lead one of the things I'm getting here? It is. Well, that is just absolutely wonderful. So time will tell on that one. Uh, a nullifier. I'm going to have to wait on tin and stuff. But can I work on at least a satchel and have that? So we need tin and some wool. I don't think it matters the color of wool. They're just kind of doing that. So let's do that. All right. So let's make some shears. Um, I guess I could do some steel ones. Is that That's a thing. It is a thing. All right. So that's going to give me wool. And then heck was the other thing I needed. I got such a good memory. Um, tin. Yes, the tin. All right, are we actually collecting tin here? All right, nickel, so probably on the other side. Uh, lead, gold, no, no tin yet. Oh, boy. All right, was there something else I can use instead of tin? Tin, tin. Um, I guess that's just a diet. So I got no choice but to get tin, huh? Was there even tin in these uh in these chunks? Oh boy. So we can just uh, check this one. Iron, coal, copper, lead, gold, nether quartz, uh, aluminum. Okay, so no tin on that one. I wonder. Coal, iron. I think this. Is gonna get screwed and there's gonna be no no copper here or no tin just gonna get everything else but <laughs> that would be kind of my luck all right we'll do it again that'll be whatever's coming up for the next one coal iron copper 
I could play with those in particular resources, but nickel gold, see? I think we're going to get totally screwed. Not going to get any nether quartz. Coal iron. Uh, horrible. Silver lead. Silver, I think, is a tier 3 ore. Or no, it isn't. It's tier 2. Sorium. Yeah, okay, so we're not getting get any there. Um... So let me make two more of those and then we'll find a we'll find one of those nodes shouldn't be too complicated to make um or at least yeah well, maybe two so let's grab that 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 we'll just throw this in here like so uh we're gonna need two chests after a while all right so what are we doing here this I need eight of these. Perfect. Then I need, yeah, I think I already had one in there, but it's all good, it doesn't matter. And then we're good for that. So let's make two. So now we got those two burners. Yeah, see, I had one extra. Uh, we need an iron drill head first. So we'll make, oh, I guess as much as we can here. There you go. Oh, someone's having fun with their car. We're just burning it up, burning it up. Next to me, you know you're going to hear the cops go out there. Woo! That'd be super funny. All right, then I think I just need uh, one more, right? To make eight. And then... Yes. That is beautiful. Awesome. All right, so now we got that. Now let's find out where we can get some tin here, right? Tin ore. So, uh, which way is north? Uh, ass facing north. Okay, good. Let's grab our tin. Uh, we are here. So just to my right, are you serious? All right, I believe you. I believe you, you say so. So we'll go F9, that's north, and this is to my right. So just back over here, it says there's 10. Let's try here. Look at that, look at that. So that means this one here is gonna have 10 in it too. All right, just want to verify before I put my little gizmo down here. And then if it does, well, then that's perfect. Then we have at least 10 coming in as well. That's perfect. Not a lot though. Well, if you want to compare it to like the other, the other chunks, maybe 10 is just kind of like a, a slower resource maybe. Who knows? All right, so that there, I'm going to need some... We can turn this off now. Please, two. Defeat it. All right. That, 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 that. That's beautiful. So now we should be getting tin. That's good. That's very good. Let's go after some sh some sheep. I believe. Uh, where can I find some sheep? Looks like there's some over here. So that way we can get some wool. Hmm. There was a brown sheep there too. It did say we could use any colors, right? So, oh, that guy was pretty generous in the amount of wool he gave me. I think we should be good after this guy here. There you go. We got four pieces of wool. That's all we needed. <clears throat> Absolutely beautiful. No complaints. All right, let's go over here and uh, did we get tin yet? So I just need to smelt a couple of pieces of tin here. Tin. Uh, I think I only needed two, but that will do. So we'll just toss that in there. We'll get two pieces of tin. Oh boy, eh? Wait, that's pretty full. All right. That's crazy. Crazy, crazy full. And then what's left on me? Just iron. That's good. 
pretty impressive pretty impressive no complaints we're gonna have all kinds of materials all kinds of good stuff and then we'll be able to get farther in this uh pretty fast i think anyways just my uh my little opinion all right so we'll put these up here and then let's go and make that satchel this is just so i can put like tools and stuff in here uh let's save that up there Perfect. Uh, what really? It's they all the, the what? One of them has to be a different color. Okay, well that's fine. I'll just choose yellow. How's that? Will yellow work? So if I go like this, really. I'm kind of baffled here at the moment. Or how would that go? Yeah, above it. These here. And that there. And I don't get it. Really? All right. Let's go try killing a couple of cows and see if that works. I don't know what to say. All right. Let's, uh, I guess grab that and that since we never weren't given a sword at the beginning of the game so we'll create one and then let's go get some leather and see if i can't see it being something that you have to unlock that would just kind of suck i know you guys give leather see, horse was better at giving me leather than than the cows were that's horrible all right all i need is three leather all right, we got our three leather. That's where we live over here. Let's give her. Oh, I can't wait till we can run faster. All right, here we go. So let's try that. All right, so now we got like a little bit of a backpack. Did uh, we don't get the quest for it? I guess we have to do the nullifier first. Man. All right, well, that will come with time. But uh, this backpack is going to be kind of good for like holding my different types of tools and things. So things I don't want to keep in there, I can just keep here. We'll bring our calculator there too. Something that we don't have to use yet, but we'll uh, we'll get there. We'll get there. So see, I can just put all a bunch of my little tools in here and free up my inventory. And uh, yeah. That's pretty good. I can put that in there. What else do I got? I got that. This thing here, I want to try to figure out how to use at one point and another too, but I guess I'm kind of full of space. I thought you could upgrade these. Like, can you make these bigger? Like, if I hit you. Oh, you can too. So, that's pretty awesome. I can upgrade these. So if I get tin nuggets and invar, invar is just nickel and iron. So let's uh, do some of that. Oh, I didn't get any nickel yet. I still have to smelt these down here. All right, so let's grab these. I'll leave the other stuff in there for now. We'll do the same thing here. We'll grab this, leave that there. Perfect. I'm so happy on that comes in pretty quick there. Those steel, those steel drill heads. They uh they do make resource gathering a little bit more enjoyable. So there we'll eventually get uh, what we need. So um, lead, nickel. Uh, we'll just force the nickel in first though. There we go. And then I'll do a little bit of lead. And that way that gets fed. Silver. Try to do a little bit of each. So that way we can get uh, some stuff here. And this should be gold. Alright, that's good. I'll uh, get us ahead a little bit there. Should be really nice. Alright, so I don't know why I have stone and that on me. But that's fine. Um, that can go here. Is there a bobble slot? No, we don't have bobble slots. That's unfortunate. That's okay. We'll just have to keep it there for now. And whenever we need it, we can just go in our inventory and grab it. But that's fine. 
So the next task at hand, uh, do we start doing power? Or do I, no, I want to go after these cobblestone generators. Mm, yes, lead. So we can just do a little bit of lead. I'm going to need four of those, which you only need four in order to make one of those casings. And then, and that's it, tin. All right, so we should be getting some lead in here now. Let's go do that. Uh, I think I'm going to need two more, maybe. Just to make sure. Come on. And then I do know that there was some of that involved. There we go. Is there any more tin? Really? Didn't I put... Uh... Oh, no, I didn't. That was the tin from... Previously, so we should be able to get some tin ore from here. We'll just toss it in a random Random chest for now and we'll just throw you in there. That sounds good. So we should be getting some tin now uh, Can I Do a craft in there doesn't let you huh? Interesting All right, let's grab some tin. I think I only need two pieces of tin not quite sure, but I'm pretty sure that's what it was. And then we'll go back over. Let's put that in here. That sounds good. So you can upgrade this cobblestone generator. And you can get like um, higher tiers of it. So there we got our first cobblestone generator. And because of that, they gave us more. So you could take these eight. Oh, you're going to have to make one more? Ha <laughs> ha, that's pretty sly. Okay. Um, so if I grab two more tin, I should be able to make one more. There we go. Come back over here. Make one of these. I don't know why I keep separating it like that there. So now we got nine. Is that not how it was or was it like that? Oh boy. Um, let's go you. Oh, you need a piece of bronze in the middle. That's why there was the eight. Oh, okay. Bronze is tin and copper. Wonderful. Oh, but didn't they, they gave me one. Man. How am I not very observant? All right, so that's good. We at least got uh, cobblestone here. So we can just throw that there. Do I have another? No, but I can make one. I can make. Oh, I did two too many. Here, we'll put that there. There. So now, if I put that on top, we got uh, cobblestone generation happening here. There we go. It's uh, relatively quick. It's better than going downstairs and mining it. That's for darn sure. And then say if I want to go higher than that, you, know, you can go to a tier 3 cobblestone generator, if I'm not mistaken, which is pretty darn good. Um, that we're going to wait to do. That we can wait. All right, so let's start doing <clears throat> some power. I think that would be the best thing to do. We'll get a little bit of power generation going, and then uh, I'll call it for that uh, for today, I think, uh, for the stream. Anyways, and I'll take a little bit of a break, and I'll come back and... We'll do a little bit more streaming. Um, here we go. So, uh, yeah, power generation. Here we go. We'll just go and bookmark this so we know what the heck we're doing. Come over here. Make one of these. Now, these don't make, like, a lot of... Oh. So, we're going to have to get into the Coke oven thing, then. Well, it didn't... Automated coal. See, this is something else I want to get into afterwards there. Uh, we can automate coal. So if you make a torch, right? And it's more profitable if you go... We'll do it by uh, example here. So if you go to a torch, okay? And we open up a torch. And there's different ways of making torches, right? So the most profitable way would be this one right here the coal coke reason being is because we have no way of like farming um 
wool at the moment and I'm not going to go and farm wool to, to do that. So I think the best thing to do would be to make coal coke. So if you make coal coke, you get six torches. But if you take six torches and you put those through a sawmill, well, actually four torches, you get one piece of coal back. So you can kind of like recycle your coal and get infinite coal if you make enough coal coke and all that good stuff so we can make all kinds of steel and yeah it's it's quite the loophole for it's intended to there uh, the way they have that so uh, another thing too here is uh, for making steel they're just trying to show you that uh, using coal coke is the better way to go especially uh, blocks of coal coke you're going to get more so you would get for every steel every block of coal coke you should get 20 steel that's pretty much all what they're they're getting that, so they gave us uh, 20 iron and that. So if we go and remove this and we put that in that, it'll do exactly those 20, So, which is pretty cool. No complaints. So let's grab the steel that was in here. Let's throw that away since we don't kind of need it at the moment. We will be using that, though. Like, Don't get me wrong. Um, there are uses for that. Oh, this is uh, my storage. Um, that's good. So, uh, what did we need here? We need treated wood, so we need coal coke ovens. All right, so let's do coke ovens. I think I already have that marked up here, coke brick. So, yeah, let's just grab some of this. And then we can grab this. So we can just put a whole ton of that in there. And a whole ton of these. So you might think that might be a little like, excessive, <clears throat> but uh, we're going to make a bunch of coal coke later on and it's going to be completely worth it. So um, let me just go set up something temporary. But, oh, there's something else we can make. That's going to clear all that up really quick. So if we go like this, go like this, and we go diamond, and we find this right here the sickle this thing is a godsend check this out you want to talk about clearing grass really easily bam 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 oh yeah look at that that's just great and then you can say you know like beating the heck out of everything on the ground you kind of get to clear nice big areas and just so much better since like there's so much grass over here it's like trimming the lawn you can just go around and make sure to pick up all that stuff um at least the the dyes anyways the dyes could be useful for later on but we'll clear a nice big area out here and then we'll uh put some coke ovens down here and then we'll start making some some creosote and all that good stuff and then that's going to help us make uh, the treated wood, which we need. And we're going to automate that later on, too. I got a really great way of automating that. Uh, that's pretty easy to do. All right. So I guess the first thing we'll do is uh, we'll do this. Uh, back here wouldn't be too bad, eh? So let's try to line it up with this one a little bit. There, one, two, three. That's perfect. So uh, I'm going to have to hit this with a hammer afterwards because it's like that same kind of multi-block structure. How do I do this? Do I make it go like that or do I bring it out like this? Let's make it uh, go like this. And then let's just do three for now, I think. Just because I don't have like a lot of material to be to be uh, using in them, so even though it just takes co uh, coal, which isn't so bad, but we're really not automating that yet, so not a big deal, not a big deal. All right, so grab that, grab our little man bag, and then we hit these here like. So, there we go. You're worrying me there for a second. I was like, why aren't you working? All right, so 
that's good that's good we can grab some coal in here i said i got three of them and then if you just go throw coal into these things they will turn that into coal coke and you're also going to get a liquid on the side it's called creosote and then that creosote you can use to make all the um all the treated wood planks that we uh that we need right which is pretty awesome that's pretty awesome and then that's pretty much all it so that's where i'm going to call it uh for now so if you're watching on twitch you uh want to hang out for a few more minutes we just kind of take a small little break and uh that's it so if you're watching on youtube thanks for coming along and have a good day peace take care